Welcome back to Two Fox. If you're just joining us, I'm your host and producer, John Cancio. Today, in celebration of Halloween, we have on psychics. We do have psychics on throughout the year, but uh, we bring them back. And we've got two great psychics. It's our thank you show to uh, two wonderful psychics who were very generous to me in helping me raise money for the show. So we want to give them another hand for that. Okay. <laughs> Next with us, we have psychic Lynn Cooper. Everyone, welcome Lynn Cooper to the show. Thank you. Glad to be here. Thank you very much for being here today. It's nice I, to it's, see you. I, it's wonderful to be here. It's wonderful to be back. And you were a, amazing people the last time. Thank uh, you very much. At the much. benefit, everybody was talking. And you Thank were, you um, very much. That was nice to hear. So, Thank you. And you, you work a little bit differently. You take a piece of paper, basically. Well, actually, I write everything. You uh, write everything People out. say it looks like automatic writing. Um, 16 years ago when I started doing what I do, I didn't write it out. I would hold the object the person would wear and I would just talk. What happened then is that I, would, I had a tendency to second guess myself and if I got something that was really kind of out there, I'd be like, oh wait a minute, I can't say that. I'm gonna look like a fool or a... And, and anyway, make a long story short, somebody that I was taking classes with said, why don't you try writing it out because I think for you it would be a normal, natural thing. And they were absolutely right. And now I write everything out. I write very fast. In a 10-minute reading, you get 10 pages of information. Basically, yeah, Five pages, 10 pages two sides. Of, of just writing, yes. and you take the, the name and the birthday. No, no birthday. Uh, no birthday, just the just first the name. name. I don't okay, do, just the first the thing, name. And I don't even want the last name. I don't, okay, I just, and then the after name. you sit there for 10 minutes, you give them all the information that you've written on the Well, pages. actually, what I do is I go back and forth. I write a couple of pages, then I read it to them. Mm -hmm. And I do, I do look to them for confirmation as I'm going along. For instance, if I get a dog around them, a dog is my symbol for a loyal friend, but it could also be a literal dog that they have around the house. So I have to say, I get, I'm getting a dog. I have to actually say to them, do you have a dog? If they don't, then I know it's my symbol. Mostly it's symbolic. And you do something called, what is it, psychometry, where you psychometry, hold the object? Psychometry, holding an object the person wears, watch, ring, keys, uh, something personal. It's it, better that it's not an antique that belonged to one of your relatives that's no longer around because then I'll pull them in. Not that that's bad, but I want the object you've had on, and, and the longer the better. Okay, so I have a ring here. Let's try it out. Okay. Let's see what it is. And this, you've worn this a long time. For, I think, maybe a couple years. Okay. Um... I'm, first thing I get on this ring is that um, you've got, you've got a, there's like a crossroads or a fork in the road where you're going to, and within a few weeks, you're going to have to make a decision. Um, I'm getting boxes around you very strongly. I feel like you're going to have to move. There's a move. I feel it's more of a personal move than a business move, but they're boxes. I feel like a move. Um, I wanted to say the name Andrea or Anne, 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 a name like Andrea around you, that kind mm -hmm. of name. Don't know. It's a, that's, mm -hmm. that's either it's a, a professional connection, maybe personal, but it feels like the name Anne, Andrea. Hmm. Um, I feel like October 15th is going to be a very special day. I feel like October 15th is going to be a surge in what's going on maybe here at the studio. I don't know, but there's like a big... Like you're going along and it's like pfft, up, and this is what I, I got on that. Okay. So that's uh, well, thank you. So thank I don't you. know if any of that made sense, but I did see boxes yeah. around you. Okay. Well, 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 I guess what in this case it's the psychic likes to hear confirmation from the person they read. Like what made sense on that, or what clicks right now, or can you can you say? Uh, it doesn't click right now. But okay, I mean, that's right. I think about it a little okay. bit. Okay, <laughs> okay, but I do feel boxes around you, and I feel like you're going to move. Okay, so I'll right. keep that, I'll keep that in mind. Thank all you. All right. Okay, and we have questions in the audience. I see fingers. Now, uh, let, let me explain okay. something. Okay. You can ask a question about like your your life, or actually, um, you don't even have to ask me anything. If you just want to give your name, I can just see what I get from that. Or you can say, I'm, I'm I want to know that my relative over there is okay on the other side. What can you tell me? And you don't have to give a name. You can just say my so-and-so. Hi, my name is Ada. Ada. Ada, yes. I have a question. Yes. Um, I would like to know if I'm in danger to you. Uh, no, I don't feel you are. Um, I feel like there's, I do feel that there's somebody around you that has had a lot of problems. 
a lot of issues. Um, I see them going, leaving the area, going. Uh, I don't know whether they're being led away, you know, if you get my drift, mm -hmm. or that they're, that, but, they're, but I see them leaving and not bothering you. And right. I feel that you're, things are going to calm down around you. I feel that you've gone through a several year cycle of things just crazy. And this is going to start settling down and you're going to, it's going to be better. You're going to, I just see you kind of, and the, and the holidays are going to be better for you too. And I, I want to add on something. I feel money coming in that you've been really needing. Uh, I don't know if somebody owes you money or there's been a settlement or something held up, but that's coming. Okay? Okay. Uh -oh. oh, wow. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Yeah. Got me out TV diet. I don't, I don't like to do that to everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Yes. Um, I'm Linda. And I just, Linda? Linda, yeah. yeah I and I'm just going to ask you, you what go you right feel. Ahead. No, I'm going to just okay. ask you what you feel. Okay. Uh, actually, I like to stand if that's okay because yeah. I feel like the diaphragm has to die. Uh, I feel like you've been working very, very hard. I almost see you like just digging and digging and trying to dig yourself out out of something. Mm -hmm. I don't know if this is a financial thing or what, but again, I feel like this, there's a turnaround due very soon. Um, I'm getting October 24. This is a specific date. I get a job offer coming your way or something higher, like you're going along and it's higher. Um, you have somebody around you, Phil? Phil? Fr fr no. Okay, maybe spirit? Fr Nope. Okay. With that. Well, there's somebody with an F name or PH name okay. that is going to be around you, and this person might have to do with your new job or help you in some way, and okay. that's coming. Um, I get boxes around you, too. I see you moving. Oh, good. I see you Where moving. Where am I going? Well, um, <laughs> I feel like... I feel like, I have a strong desire to move. Like, Well, I, I feel like... Actually, I do feel it's relocating. Okay. I feel like you're relocating. I want to say south, but I'm not real clear. It might be west of here, but I'm getting, uh, I'm getting those two possibilities. I get, I get two people, well, I get, well, <laughs> I, get two, I get two different people are ha asking you to come down or come out, and you're going to, I feel like you're, if I look at a map, you're going to go west okay. versus south. Okay. But you do have two options. Um, minor health issue around you that's been a little bit weird. Well, it, again, around you, meaning oh, somebody around somebody you. Else. Oh, yeah, and, definitely. Okay. And I feel that's going to be fine, oh, no thank problem. God. Thank God. Nothing to worry about. Thank and I'll God. leave that with you. Awesome. And maybe we'll be in the same neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> well, not if you're going. Now she's going west. That would be I'm nice. I'm going to keep standing. I like to stand.